This storm season we're expecting higher than average rain. The Bureau of Meteorology have forecast a La Nina alert, which means more rains, more storms and possibly more floods. So I'm encouraging the community to get ready for this season's storm season. We've already had more than 500 calls for flood rescue, life-threatening assistance this year so far, so it's, uh, it's, it's not a good look for, for things to come. I think there's going to be a lot, a lot of bad weather our way. We need to be prepared. We're prepared, ready to go um, every day, whether it's weather like this or, or really bad weather in the middle of the night. We're, we're preparing, we're training, we're ready to go. Uh, the SES, of course, are a, a vital part of, uh, of, of our emergency services response to, uh, uh, to those conditions, to those um, uh, any pending emergencies that occur because of those conditions. And this weekend, the SES will be reaching out to the community to make sure they're prepared uh, for the dangers facing storms. I take this opportunity, though, to warn the community not to drive into floodwaters uh, and put themselves at risk. Our members will come out to any calls for assistance for both rescuing people and rescuing animals. Look, first of all, just uh, if there's um, flooding in your area, just never walk, ride or drive through flood water. It's incredibly hazardous, it's incredibly cold, it's full of contaminants, it's full of snakes and spiders, and your vehicle could get washed away and you could drown. Put your arms up, reach out, arms up! Grab on! You wouldn't walk into a bushfire uh, so why would you drive into floodwaters? Yet tragically in the last eight months alone we've had 500 requests for assistance because of um, uh, people who have gone through uh, floodwaters. Uh, and despite the fact that these messages go out time and time again, people still ignore the warnings from the State Emergency Services and that's a tragedy. Stay in the car for me, we'll get you. Stay there. Don't expect that you can get to the other side. It only takes 15 centimetres of water to cause you trouble and 30 centimetres to wash a car away. It's very important that we maintain our safety, make good decisions and don't take the risk.